Hey guys, Anthony here. It is um, Monday night, about 8 o'clock, March 18th, 2019. I wanted to do this video quick to um, introduce you to this link. I'll put the link in the description box, and this is the page that it will bring you to. And it's uh, a newsletter from the desk of Jonathan Hollerman and Grid Down Consulting. Uh, which you um, you guys, some of you guys may know Jonathan Hollerman, others may not. In the prepping world, he's uh, fairly popular, I would think. Uh, I have two of his books. I've read one and partially through the other one. I do keep in touch with him via Instagram. He's up in the uh, Pittsburgh, Pen Pennsylvania area. And um, he puts out some really interesting information. He's very well, very well rounded and knowledgeable, ex-military uh, he was a SEER instructor. Uh, he knows a lot about electromagnetic pulse, um, geometric, geo, um, you know, the sunstorms uh, that could hit us and knock out our power grid. And so what he does is in this recent uh, update from his newsletter, there's lots of information here, and you could kind of um, peruse through it. I'm just going to go through it quick so you guys could see here. Uh, apparently, there was a, a lawsuit against Wise uh, Food Company, you know, these long-term food companies that tell you you're getting X amount of weeks or months worth of food, and you really don't get nearly as much as you think you're getting because they're false advertising. And so uh, Wise Food has been, uh, I guess, indicted on this, and they're uh, – um, Apparently, there's a hundred thousand of their customers that the um, has been their names and addresses and everything have been turned over to the government. So now the government knows who bought their food, and could easily find out who's prepping, and what they have. So that's just another um, just another thing to worry about, guys. Um, also, he's got a, a section here. This is him here. Okay. Uh, he also does grid retreat research. In other words, if you're looking to uh, buy a piece of land or a property to build, you know, a, a grid down location, uh, he specializes in coming out and helping you find the, the right spot and telling you how to get it built and from from any types of budgets. Um, that's one of the things he does through his website. Uh, he's got an Amazon page. He's got um, a couple videos on YouTube. He's working on a couple of books right now, Dark Skies, Survival Theory 2. Um, he recorded some episodes recently on the radio, which you guys uh, should go listen to. Uh, he talks here about what happened in Venezuela and what uh, he was kind of alluding to from what I read in this uh, section is that the U.S. may – have led this uh, cyber attack on Venezuela. Our technology and our offensive acts, um, actions have um, might have been what uh, was the cause of this. Um, also down here, if you haven't seen Zero Days, I highly recommend it. You could watch it on like Netflix. Uh, I'm not sure if it's on YouTube, uh, but you can get it on the various streaming channels. Uh, that has to do with the Stuxnet virus, I believe that we uh, planted or supposedly planted in, uh, in the Iranian systems. Um, so that's a good movie. Um, Trump's new foreign policy on cyber attacks um, talks about uh, Trump wanting to go on the offensive and attacking nations before they get to us, you know, and the pros and cons about that. And then um, he puts some links down here with all different articles, citing different articles that you guys can look at. Uh, one of the things I'm watching, I don't know if I'm going to get through it tonight, but it's right here on the EMP threat. Uh, it's a over a two hour and 20 minute round table discussion with Homeland Security and lots of uh, people in the, um, in the know in the EMP industry. Um, and so I just listened to about the first 20 minutes of it. So if you click on this link here, it brings you to that roundtable discussion, which I'm going to watch the whole thing because it sounds re very interesting. And basically, at the end of the day, uh, nobody is doing anything. So um, it's been over 15 years 
since the last commission had made recommendations, and that was around the 9-11 time period. And I don't think anybody has done anything in our country to harden our structures or our systems. So this is a very real problem, guys, especially uh, for preppers, uh, because, you know, the grid goes down in an EMP or some type of cyber attack. Um, we're in a lot of trouble. Our country's in a lot of trouble. We can't go a couple, more than a couple of days without going crazy. So this is something very real. I think we need to uh, educate ourselves on it. Uh, and by watching this uh, roundtable discussion, listening and, and taking in what they're saying, he even gives you some sections here on uh, what areas to listen to to hear what they're uh, some important clips of that um, of that hearing. And that was just at the end of November was the hearing. Uh, the overall grid down threat. Uh, I didn't I didn't read that yet. I have to get to that. Cybersecurity, what the Russians and Chinese are doing already. Uh, and uh, we're playing catch up, basically. Talks here about quantum computing. Uh, and also, um, he's coming out with a book recommendation that every prepper should be reading. And I think I know which book it is. I think um, the gentleman that I post on my channel a lot, Selko, from uh, One Year in Hell, from the Bosnian Wars, Selko has the audio versions of his survival in that one year of hell. And he also has several articles that I've cited on my channel over the years. And I think he's putting out a book now. So that might be the book that Jonathan's recommending. Uh, he's got some artwork going on with his EMP series. His books are really good, guys. Uh, go to his um, Amazon page and... Um, you know, get his books and read them. Very, very well written. He's very knowledgeable. He's a very good guy, a family man, a Christian man, and um, highly recommend um, you checking out his site, his um, and all the uh, services that he offers, including the books that he's written, and now this um, newsletter that I I uh, subscribe to, and you could subscribe to it as well. So um, that's my video tonight. Just wanted to get that out there. Wanted to get these links out there to keep people in the know. There's some people on my channel that might be new to prepping. And this is a great little section to go to to gain some knowledge and find out what's going on, you know, around the world in a, in a, in a, quick, uh, a quick newsletter. So that's my video tonight, guys. Let me know what you think. Um, but like I said, I'm going to watch the, try to watch the whole roundtable discussion this week and then may, maybe make some comments on it uh, for this weekend. But uh, things are very real, guys. Things are getting real and have been real for the last couple of years. The heat is on, I believe. Uh, I believe we're in a, a, um, a time in our lives when uh, we could witness some terrible uh, destruction and terrible upheaval uh, within our country here, um, just based on what's going on in the illegal activity that our government is perpetrating on the people or right under our noses is just uh, very disheartening. It's very uh, sad. It's very real, though, and uh, it's not going to let up. Don't think it's going to go away just because you, you and I put our heads in the sand. This isn't going away. So if you have small children or grandchildren or um, are looking forward to their future living in a free country, you've bet to, you've better um, – Educate yourself, prepare, and um, all levels of prepping, not just buying a gun and some ammo and some Band-Aids, but an entire system needs to be put into place for a long-term survival. And um, it's going to really come to a head, I, I believe. So that's my video tonight, guys. Take care. Stay ready. God bless. And uh, more videos to come. Anthony signing off.